Hello, hello, hello again. This is your friendly hood collector. And before I start, I say you can follow me at The Hood Collector on IG. You can also follow me at Big Constantine Hood Collector on Ute on t Twitter. And you can follow me at Arbison the Hood hood collect the hood collector on youtube and you can follow this page as well so hit that follow button and we're gonna start off we got a very new figure and it came out it just recently just dropped a couple days ago this is the mcfarland toys dc collaborative multiverse the flash figure and this is the flash figure this is um in the metal wave that they just released and it's got a bunch of accessories that come with it. It doesn't have a builder figure fee, so oh well. But it does come with a ton of a bunch of accessories that show like the speed force that he has that, that he uses to be the flash basically. Um we're gonna look at the side. This side over here says the flash DC rebirth. We have on the back we have the Batman, this is the Green Lantern. I think it's Earth, um, what is it, Earth 32, Earth 22. We have Batman, Earth 1, the Batman Metal. We have Azrael from the last series, the previous series that they had. We have Batman, Earth 44. And we have Batman, the Grim Knight, okay. in this series. Okay, so we got the Flash, and we're going to get him out the box and take a closer look at him. Okay, we got him out of the package, and I just want to say, this is actually my second Flash figure. I think I had one from one of the previous other series that wasn't McFarlane. And this is my, like, this is like a Flash I actually like. Um, this is the Flash from the um, DC Multiverse, the DC Rebirth series. And this is the Flash. So we're going to take a look at the articulation. First, we're going to take a look at what accessories it comes with. He comes with all these little lightning things, speed force things, it pegs, and different things that go on different parts of his body. to show it off. And... So now we're going to look at the sculpt itself. The sculpt itself is a really good flash. I actually like it. I like it a lot. And hopefully we get a Wonder Woman from the, the Flash Flashpoint, which would be really dope because the one that I have is terrible. Um, but back to the Flash, this is actually a really, 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 really good sculpt. And as usual... McFarlane comes with the flash card and it comes with the standard base. I'm using a different base because it's clear and it works a little bit better for what I'm doing for my purposes. Um, but otherwise, this is a really, really, really good flash. Now let's look at the articulation. All right, so we're gonna look at this arm Okay, the only thing I don't like is his hand because I feel like his hand should be doing something. His hand should be, the finger should move. Um, and it stays kind of like that. Um, he's got like butterfly joints up in here. Like most McFarlane toys. We got the head that goes all the way around. We got the arms that go all the way around. And the ball joint. Butterfly joints up in there. We got back and forth. We got a double jointed elbow. We got the wrist, because we know we got a ball joint at the wrist. It goes all the way around. We got a torso twist. We got a little bit of movement in the waist, just a little bit. We got legs that go out about this far, really far. Wow. Go out about that far. And we got legs that go forward. Go a little bit back, a little bit back. We got a double jointed knee, another double jointed knee. We got ankles that actually they spin around. You got front and back movement on them. They go all around. 
The only thing I don't like is his hand. His hand is not, I don't really like the hand. I think the hand should have been like a karate hand. But otherwise, this is the Flash from the DC Rebirth series. And I think some more have come out our own way out. I think they got the Batman, the um, Thomas Wayne Batman. And I think that's shit sold out already at Target because of the damn scalpers. You know, because I always buy two because I want to buy one to collect and one to keep in the box. Just to keep it in the box and display it in the box. But people bought them all up, so the pre-orders are all done. And that's something that's coming forward. I know another, the Batman, the the Metal Wave, the Wonder Woman with the bald head and the mohawk, that's coming out soon too. That's coming out next year, 2021. So I'm excited about that. But this is The Flash from the DC Rebirth. And it just got released. It was an Amazon exclusive. And I'm not fan of exclusives, but Amazon did a pretty good job of getting it out right away. I didn't have to wait a bunch of time for it because I know I ordered some other rebirth, some other fi figures. The Green Lantern, the Earth Twenty Two Bat on um, Batman, and that that just came like last weekend. That came out at the beginning of the month. So, but otherwise, this is a really cool figure, a really good figure. And you can put him in a lot of interesting poses because he's very limber. He's very flexible. He's very flexible. You just gotta have a little stand or have a stand that he can like stand up on. And we're gonna see what this looks like with the pegs attached. Okay, so I think this probably goes here. This is the biggest one. No, it does not. Okay. I'm assuming these all go someplace. Alright, I think I got it now. This goes in here on his back, like so, or like so. These probably go, these go on the arms, like so. Like so. I think that's wrong. Put this, I think this one goes here. That fits in there. Oh, crap. That goes there. Now this, I don't know where it will go. I have no idea. So I guess this is maybe an extra piece or something. It goes somewhere. I'm going to figure it out. Because they don't have any instructions. But I know this, all these go someplace. So let's see what this looks like on a stand with all the pieces. With most of the pieces in it. Okay, that looks pretty dope. Let's get the face up. Move them so you can get a good view of them. Okay, and that is the Flash from the Rebirth series with an extra piece that I don't know where it goes. And I'm going to have to figure that out. 
maybe it goes in the stand or something. That's all I could think is it probably goes on the stand. With the stand, I'm looking at it, it only in a box, it only got one peg, so I don't know where that's exactly supposed to go. But we're gonna figure it out. And once I figure it out, I will definitely post a picture of it so you can see what it looks like. But this is the hood collector. Um, once again, like, subscribe, dislike, comment. Just let me know what you think of this figure. Okay, this is the hood collector, and I am out. Ghetto Geek Hood Freak. All right, this is the hood collector again. I just want to come back real quick. Um, it actually goes in the foot. I did not realize that it went in the foot, and that's how he's supposed to look with it. Well, one of the feet is supposed to be bent, and that thing actually goes in the foot. I could not figure it out. Could not figure it out. So, this once again, this is the hood collector, and I am out. Um, Ghetto Geek Hood Freak, and this is a Flash Rebirth. I am so excited about this figure. Have a good day. Like, subscribe, follow me on my other social media platforms. Take care.